us under the rock. What do you think of that? Oh my god. What's up? This is Richie and Jamie from the Worry Wild YouTube channel and today we are going to take a day trip to Sequoia National Park. Yeah. I want to see some big trees, man. It's going to be awesome. I haven't been up there in a while. It's Memorial Day weekend so it should be pretty busy there, I, I would imagine. Yeah. I'm a little worried about that, but there's always a way to separate yourself from the crowd and go off and find some private time. Sequoia National Park is about two and a half, three hours um, on paper away from Los Angeles. The entrances. The entrances. Uh, once you get there, the entrance is going to take you up a crazy, windy, mountainy type of road that's going to take another hour or so. So, you know, it's it's a ride, man. It's, it's three or four hours to get up into the uh, heart of it. And it's about eight o'clock in the morning. We've been on the road for about a half hour already. So, uh, yeah, let's just see where today goes. Yeah. Sequoia National Park, let's go. Deep shit Francis right now. We're in deep shit now, Francis. Oh, shit. Uh, well, we're almost to the entrance of Sequoia National Park, but as it is Memorial Day weekend, it is packed. <laughs> and there is a nice mile or two long line of traffic. One mile. Going up to the entrance. Map it a guide, please. Thank you Let's so much. Day, okay? Take you care. Too. So we got through the entrance gate of Sequoia National Park. It is very busy today, being Memorial Day weekend. Uh, but it's a beautiful day, and we're gonna take a ride up this mountain and get into these big trees, man. I'm stoked up. Yeah. Should be beautiful up there. When you come to Sequoia National Park, you can buy your pass online on recreation.gov. It's $35, it lasts for a week. They send you a PDF file, so you can just throw it right into your uh, wallet on your phone. And, um, we probably just saved ourselves like a half an hour of well, sitting in traffic. Yeah, we definitely saved ourselves some time. You can go all the way to the right lane if you have a pass already and they kind of zip you through, so that's good. Yeah. But so when you come into Sequoia National Park and you get through the gate, you're gonna take this long, windy road up this mountain, a lot of switchbacks, just all the way up. And it's gonna take you a while, but it is a beautiful drive, as you can see. Let's see if I can show you something pretty right around this corner here. Yeah, this will do.
just got up to Sequoia National Park. We decided to take a little hike on the Tokapa Falls Trail. And uh, we're gonna have a seat right here, have a little lunch, settle in. It's about one o'clock in the afternoon. It took a while to get up here. <clears throat> but uh, but yeah, let's see what we can see. Yeah, it's pretty. Make, make the most of it. Absolutely. I see some trout like right, right under me. I'm so pissed. I don't have a rod. Oh man. Next time I come up here, check this out. I am just beside myself <laughs> that I didn't bring my trout here. Uh, all right, so we're hiking our way up to see a nice waterfall, apparently. Um, we're just kind of exploring today. Yeah. And then we're gonna try to show you some of the uh, cool stuff you can do on a day trip up here that we've done already. But right now we're trying something new. Located next to the Lodgepole Campground, the Tokapa Falls Trail is a moderate four mile out and back hike that follows the Kawea River all the way up to a beautiful 1,200 foot waterfall. I keep thinking to myself, you know, there's a big payoff coming with a waterfall, but like this whole trail is a payoff. It's insane. It's so pretty. To that waterfall. This is an awesome hike so far. But we're getting there, man. Let's go. Yeah. What do you think of that? Oh my god. That is amazing. Alright, well we made it up to the falls. It is gorgeous, man. Look at that. Look at the sky. Mountain. Falls. It's insane, dude. There's a, there's a decent amount of people up here, but uh, yeah, I would definitely recommend this this hike as a must-do when you come to Sequoia. It's, it's pretty dope. It's a, it's, a, it's a fair amount of uphill, obviously, because yeah. you got to get to but, a waterfall. But it's not but, so, so bad. But it's so worth it. Yeah. Look at this. But, man, it's nice. All right, I, uh, I think we're, we're going to head back down, and uh, we're going to see what else uh, that we can find. Yeah, check out some other spots. Try to show you some other stuff. Let's go. Pretty awesome, man. You see that moss on that tree? Little survival tip. They say that moss only grows on the north side of trees. It's not always the case because you can see on that tree, it's grown on the opposite side. Very, very weird. You can see it. And I have a compass and that is north right there. 
So that tree is telling the truth. But that tree is not. So it's weird. Sometimes it's true, sometimes it's not. Sometime in the very near future, you will be seeing a Where We Wild video that consists of us, well, me especially, <laughs> fly fishing this river. Take that to the bank. All right, man, so we just hit this Tokapa Falls Trail. Tokapa. That was pretty awesome. I really recommend that on a day trip. You come up here for the day, hit that hike. It's not so bad. A yeah. little bit of uphill. Uh, not so, so bad though. Beautiful scenery. Not a bad way to spend time. Oh my God, you follow this river all the way up. Yeah. It is beautiful. And then once you get up to the falls, it's insane. Yeah. It's absolutely breathtaking, insane. Look at this. So, Sequoia day trip, activity number one, Tokapa Falls Trail. Yeah. Dope. Beautiful. So beautiful. All right, what's next? So we are on our way to see our old buddy, the General, General Sherman, the largest tree on earth. As you can tell, there are a lot of other people that uh, want to visit him as well, like this. Star of the show. Just to show you how big some of these trees are, there's a little scale for you. Absolutely insane. Absolutely insane. Crazy. And speaking of insane, That's it. look at him. General Sherman. Come on, let's get up on him. What up, G? Hello, old friend. <laughs> How are you feeling today? Unbelievable. Another thing that you have to do when you go do a day trip at Sequoia is visit this guy right here. General Sherman, the largest tree on earth. Pretty awesome. Yeah. It never gets, it never gets old, man. No. And it's cool too, because the last time we were here, it was covered There's with snow. snow in the ground, yeah. um, so it's like, it seems even bigger than it was. Yeah. <laughs> Is that even possible? Uh, I mean, I can't even give any scale to this thing, really. Yeah. Like, I mean, I can show you. It looks like nothing, though. I mean, It is just massive. Check out how many people are waiting to get in front of this General Sherman sign. Excuse me. It's a lot of people. It's not the tallest or the widest, but the overall volume of its trunk makes it the biggest tree on earth. Pretty awesome. All right, well, we're it's gonna try to, see to you, yeah, absolutely. We're gonna try to escape the, uh, the crowd here. Gotta head up this way. Never gets old. Every time I see this thing, it blows my mind. The General. Take care, bud. See you next time. It's starting to rain a little bit. It rained a little bit uh, earlier on our first hike. But uh, we're just um, getting out of seeing General Sherman. Jamie stopped off to use the bathroom real quick. And it's raining, man. When you come up here, be prepared for any kind of weather. I'm actually so surprised how warm it's been today. Every time I've come up here, it's been really, really chilly. So. Always bring a jacket, always bring a sweatshirt, always bring a rain jacket, just have the right stuff in the car. Even if you leave it in the car, you can go dip in and grab it. Poncho, just be prepared up here. Weather changes like that. All right, let's go see what else we can find, huh? Whoa. We already did one hike today. We're gonna do another one. It's about uh, 6.30, gets dark probably in about an hour and a half. We're gonna hit the Big Trees Trail. The Big Trees Trail is an easygoing 1.3 mile loop around a peaceful meadow. You'll be able to get plenty of up close views of the massive sequoia trees in the area. You might even spot some wildlife along the way too, so keep your eyes peeled.
is awesome. Big Trees Trail. Check that out if you ever come up on a day trip. It's pretty easy going. Yeah. Really pretty. Walk around that meadow. Uh, it's probably going to start getting dark soon. Look at all these trees, man. it up man awesome day yeah awesome day solid solid day trip i had a blast if you enjoyed this video don't forget to hit like and let us know in the comments what some of your favorite things to do in sequoia are it's an amazing place yeah. and uh yeah if you enjoy this sort of thing don't forget to hit subscribe thanks so much for watching we'll see you next time later If you want to see more videos just like this one, be sure to check out the rest of the Where We Wild YouTube channel where we post a brand new video every week. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you get notified whenever we post a new adventure. Thanks for watching.